Igbo, the great people in the Oma time. Una Waliala, Lotanolo, Bikon Lotanolo. Document Yanin in Yunuwaosa, Emecha, Agagari Claire Mohanile, Chukokika Diama Sunota, Lotanolo, who won't actually charge on him because Simon Ufo only Bumo will be up a year. Dempa, Karanda will see you. Manahina, you know, Bikon, Lotanolo. Lotanolo will be on my Bikon, Lotanolo. Ejo Isekiri, Ibo, Ibibio, Ebanke, and all their friends living in the north. This is a clarion call for you all to come back home. A stitch in time says nine. We don't share anything in common with Hausa Fulani Oligaki. They don't value life, but we do. The Arewa Youth Fit Notice Order has the blessings of the Islamic Nigerian government. This is how 1966 massacre started. Had I known, always come at last. Makana Ndo Kainye Jazia. Don't say nobody told you. Lotabano, Olo. If you think we are insulting you, you are making a very big mistake. Because you insulted yourself from the onset. Come to think of it. Have you seen an Aosa Fulani man rent a room apartment in Igbo land? Not to talk of building houses? The answer is no. Come back home. I am Hosoka. I am Hosoka. I can cry again. Great Biafans living in the northern part of the animal farm named Nigeria. It is true the northern city's huge sojourning is quite more developed than your homes. You made it and you build those cities you think you prefer. Come back home and let's build Biafra together. Now, Arewa people has asked you out. We all know they'll kill you if you don't. Don't make yourself a bond offering. Come back home. The second exodus of the Hebrews just begun. The kingdom of God is at hand. You all can hear the echoes of war and the sound of the trumpet. Our failure to learn from our past is the reason why we think Nigeria would last. Dad, mom, your children want to see you again. We don't want the house of Alani savages to end your days. Because they will haunt you by the day and night And there will be no government to save your life Please come home, let's win this fight Brothers and sisters, fathers and mothers All the evils living in the northern part of Nigeria Please come home Who oh, lies? Bless to them that listen what the Spirit is saying. It's a big thing I want to Quran, but something them say. Kill the infidel and spread their blood. Never take the infidel like a brother, no matter how good and how related they were to you. Them say, we are not brother, we are not related. But we are sharing one country. If the foundation is broken, tell me what righteous can do. But since their pastor is sure, the just shall live by faith. Come back home. Run for your life, man, I say. Mbibo kuro kusina. Alanke yirei, adige yiri wangoro. Alanfuwa, alanke yirei. Geri ngoro marie kwa giwa meroko. Mauro na yakwa chagia ya dista mama. Igera no wa madu bie fu yes. Romansions, lazas. Nay, the also. Now, Hassigi Lawa, Chai. Manasipano, Umunem, Ugasigi Lawa, Umunem, and your Egipano, Ebo Bibioso, Erika, and Labiafa. My brothers, my sisters, please come home. Why do you want to render your children here fatherless and motherless? Because of ignorance. I have wept bitterly, my heart breaks. Biko, Umunem, Latawamu. Dodo, Luano, a 
message from Biafran's Got Talent all of you brothers. to all the Biafran's who are living in the northern part of Nigeria. Document living in the north. This is a clarion call for you all to come back home. A stitch in time says nine. We don't share anything in common with our Fulani Oligatu. They don't value life, but we do. The Arewa Youth Quick Notice Order has the blessings of the Islamic Nigerian government. This is how 1966 massacre started. Had I known, always come at last. Makana, Don't say nobody told you. Lotabano, Olo. If you think we are insulting you, you are making a very big mistake. Because you insulted yourself from the onset. Come to think of it. Have you seen an house of Fulani man rent a room apartment in Igbo land? Not to talk of building houses? The answer is no. Come back home. I am Hosoka. Great Biafans living in the northern part of the animal farm named Nigeria. It is true the northern city's huge sojourning is quite more developed than your homes. You made it and you build those cities you think you prefer. Come back home and let's build Biafra together. Now Arewa people has asked you out. We all know they'll kill you if you don't. Don't make yourself a bought offering. Come back home. The second exodus of the Hebrews just begun. The kingdom of God is at hand. You all can hear the echoes of war. And Wonderful the people of the Afro love us of freedom very gingerly. I want to thank all of you that are already here. My name is Tilliman. One name is Sedek. I am always coming from the beautiful city of Vienna, as many of you may know. For those of you that are joining me for the first time, I am speaking from a land that is totally landlocked. A land that have no access to waterways and they are doing well. I am speaking from a very small country of a population of approximately 9 million in population and they remain one of the best countries in the universe. I am speaking from a country that have no pastors, no prophets, no evangelism. They don't have crusade here, they don't have Shiloh, they don't have Tari night. They don't do crossover night. There is no idiotic Ebukobi in this country. Yet they are progressing. Not only progressing, they care for the humanity, child. They don't joke with their pensioners because they know that the pensioners are old people. In other words, most of them are incapacitated to do something with their strength. Since I have worked in this country, I have never been old for a, a, a second. Every 28th, 29th of every month, the money will appear in the bank account. Nothing like allocation didn't come this year. Therefore, there's a delay. To worsen the situation, they don't have oil. They don't, they don't have uncommon kuelen, if it is in German. They don't have all these mineral resources here and there. And they are progressing. Prostitution is allowed here, very legal. They don't regard it as a sin. There's no message of hell and heaven here. They don't, they don't preach. If it's in my making, I'm going to be coming out very clearly this time around. Some of you don't know what we are fighting. I'm very sorry. Some of you are thinking that we are fighting to restore Biafra alone. And we are going to listen to it now. I want us to listen to the voice of Mazen Namdekano. 
the man that made it possible for us to begin to converge together to begin to call ourselves family when we hear IPOB one family outsider we think that yes we are from the same mother yes we are from the same mother when you begin to trace us who cares for one another we begin to speak we begin to care for the well-being of others which is not like that before some but so many people are calling me people i don't know a lot are even writing me a lot a lot now let's go our problem steeping on religion that is where the the it is called folklore for those of you that are physics inclined is a pivot upon which the stupidity of our people revolves and that religion breeds superstitiousness we need to be radical in what we believe in which is Biafra some of, some of them are fighting over a white man concept but nevertheless let's go let's go I told you so a few weeks ago and that's what I'm saying this morning I told you so a few weeks ago that the UK and USA and the wider EU are in support of Muslims those that brought you New Testament this is what I find astonishing. The same people you call Christians in Europe. My mother has the cloth of Merisomna of England. Of Anglican Church. Blue cloth that they tie. Anyway, I refer to it as a um, social club for mothers. That's how I see it in the church. The same Christians they are here now working for Buhari. <laughs> One nature, you see the plant, they will see it and water it. Bekeina, Beke will break us in your lap. Who Naso Pasokuni will be we baron? I don't know how to preach this gospel that you may understand it. I do not know how else I can begin to articulate this message of heaven that you on earth may grasp it because here we speak the truth. For sure. The whole truth and nothing but the truth. Christians supporting <laughs> Islam. Buhari is thanking them. Not Saudi Arabia because their, their support for them is, is guaranteed. They are thanking US and the EU. They were on Sunday, don't worry, you go to church, you contribute money. One of the one set goes to Canterbury in England, Anglican Church, the other one goes to Rome, Catholic Church. Then Pentecostal will cut it into two, give half to Europa and give the same half to America. If you're an Assemblies of God Church or Jehovah's Witness. Nobody is sitting down to say, who is going to take care of my daughter and my son? How will they go to good schools? Who is going to give them life in this city? How about iPad? Why not my children playing with iPad and the Samsung tab and the smartphone to learn how to even play video games and then design it later? Some will go to your balance. After doing all of that, the same Christians of Europe will always support Islam. And they say, Buhari is thanking them. Isn't it? Before you say we made it up, no, it is being carried by a newspaper in the zoo, a reputable one. We block the news here, we don't write them. Buhari hails EU, US for their role in the elections. That is the headline. <laughs> thanking Christians for helping him defeat a Christian. I agree with you. Or leading him into power. Hey, there is God, though. I will miss that woman, honestly. Buhari is thanking EU <laughs> and the US for their role in making him into. It's a national newspaper carrying it. Who said to go? I'm going to go. 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 I'm going to
These are the same people that bombed the Twin Towers in America. This is the same people, the same Alak Oba, the same Islam, the same terrorists that keeps killing every day, beheading Western hostages. Nobody gives a damn. When, uh, oh, you people should be peaceful. If you are peaceful, the world will not recognize you. Right on here, you see, you. Buhari, that came out, are you telling me that CIA that knows everything did not know that Buhari is a terrorist? Is that, or even Charlie Obama, that CIA doesn't know that Buhari is a terrorist? Is that what you're telling me this morning? Are you telling me that the statement that Buhari opened his mouth and said about Sharia, that CIA did not hear about it? I'm not even talking about the one they discovered secretly. I'm saying, are you telling me that Obama CIA, Central Intelligence Agency in America, that specializes in killing black people that uh, who are intelligent, that's their job. They killed Patrice Lumumba, CIA killed um, Walter Rodney, they killed Thomas Sankara. It was the uh, England MI5 that killed Motala Mohammed. I will tell you who killed who. Where and when they planned it. Have we have all the data, all the information. CIA taking light to a darkened continent. But how about a mobilization? They saw every evil they support. They are today supporting. Can you tell me that a Christian country is supporting somebody who said that if he loses elections, the, the blood of the people will be the, the, the street will be filled with blood as part of his election campaign. You are telling me that Christians in Europe will support somebody who said that he's going to expand Sharia. Christianity, man. When they go like, I'm come to hear your religion, I'm telling you the truth. Can't sit down somewhere. Can't talk rubbish. Foolish people. Is there not some Christians? Foolish people. Now supporting Buhari. Openly. Buhari is thanking them. Sunday is only, is it? One day, two days a time. God, one day, go to Bula Europe. You think you have, you know something. What you're practicing is what I call retrospective superstition. I know. You have replaced the superstition based on abject ignorance to superstition based on a concept developed and perfected in Europe. Here we say it. Let me repeat the news. United States of America, European Union containing Britain, containing Italy, where is Catholic Church, containing France, all those places. Buhari, the terrorist, is thanking them for helping him to win. It is here now, as news. <laughs> people should can sit down. Anybody, if you're against Radio Biafra, it means you're a child of Satan. Hold on there. Hold on there, our leader. Master Jonathan, continue doing your good, your good job with Madam Heather. Every Saturday, try to be educating our people. Very, very important. On your night, the Maya Day and Job. Anya Baliala, Anya Baliala, Anya Baliala, and I struggle. For how many years now? And then, I need one quotation. Taz is the phone is on that. Go, go, second chronicle. Go some Psalm, Psalm 120. Read Leviticus. Born, may fast. Come on, when that nonsense got one side. All those who are, we keep calm. Nobody is talking. Anya Bella, Anya Bella. Now, we want to go straight to Biafra land. As many of you know what happened today in Biafra land. It is with a mixture of joy and sadness. Is a sacrifice. We have been paying an ultimate sacrifice in this struggle. And that is why when things is going wrong, it pains a lot. Especially those doubling into this struggle that knows nothing about. If not because of we have defeated these idiots, if I begin to play you voice record of some individuals who are in, in position of some arms and they have refused to return it back to the criminal in Finland. They recruited people on the street they don't know, just to bring down the retreat of state. They recruited tout on the street, hand them gun over. Now, they are calling them to return the gun. They say no, that they have something they want to use it for. I have the audio. But uh, we kill, we kill position, no marker, but I'm aware, nothing. 
at least it is in, now crystal clear to everybody that they didn't mean good for this dog. I have it here. Please, can you bring that gun? We, since Azoka said we don't need it anymore, we have another thing to use it for. I know, it's good. with all due respect, I will not return it. I have something to use it for. People fall today, which is the sacrifice we are paying. It's a very sad news, but at the same time, the men, many of you saw on the street, there are men that want to defend us. I know just, um, to, I think, um, Kina Sanwuru, our gallant man, no, no, we are with others. They have shown many of you how to converge in the noise, in the internet. Men on the street, in the radio. That is how we IPOB have been working with one another. That's why it's good to join the struggle. In the announcement, we know he just went here, a bit shy about the tenakwa. And we are secrecy, which is the key. No talking. Leave talking for market women. But unfortunately today, they still, the same Nigerian government open fire on our men. And some of you now, I know you will not call it anything, but when you begin to see a reprisal, you begin to say, nah, stop, make us stop this thing. People are causing war in our land. I know for you, it is Nigerian government that have the right to kill others. But when one wants to defend themselves, so what you saw today, they are ESN. And I know it's All men on the street. They are armless. They didn't come out with arms. They just said, their color you saw them parading is to show you that they are for peace. I just want to tell many of you, especially those of you that are doing obedience. Now, many of you will expect those bloggers to carry this news. Not when you see the repressor now. Oh, Kunu International Community, come and tag IPO with terrorist organization. They are killing people. They, they mowed our men down today when they are just peaceful. To the extent of showing it in, their, in what they are putting on. White, which designates peace. That they are not for violence. What we are doing is just to at least tell many of you who are not in support of what we are doing, who have been a, a pure saboteur mm -hmm. to this struggle. All people, they are all men on the street. I name make clear noise, brothers. Eastern Security Network at the State Command and the indigenous people of Biafra. IPOB peacefully in other states. They are not criminals. On a peaceful protest to demand for the release of Mazen Namde Kano. Peacefully, peacefully. And also asking the Nigerian federal government to adhere to their own court order and release Mazen Namde Kano. Viewers worldwide, this is the Instant Security Network at the State Command and the indigenous people of Biafra. IPOB and other states on a peaceful protest peaceful, to demand peaceful. for the release of Mazen Namde Kano and also asking the Nigerian federal government to adhere to their own court order and release Mazen Namde Kano. Okay, hold on there. Hold on there. Are you learning anything from this? It's a mixture of sadness and joy, like I said. What you saw here is our people. To tell the world that they are still, they, they need Biafra and they obey instruction. Did you hear it on social in social media? When you put on a na na speed na be a balloon, you get a like this. And when you make you not say we are in charge, we don't need to talk that we are in charge. We are not dragging any place with anybody. All noise. No, 
no noise. They assemble. Give one, not give one watch your mama. It's an adjust or not, but I'm still to phone your palia palaka in those this year. No, properly organized. Almost getting to one week to two weeks now. They have been organizing for this and they keep it very secret, which is very, very nice. Which is what we need. We need such a thing in this struggle. Silent over stammer, man. Now, I'm going to play you, for those of you that are watching, obedient, I know for you people, we have seized any form of mockery to your stupidity. We want to begin to reason with you. Kaimana Mumuniki, wake up. You are going to hear conversation. I don't want to, though I don't have the, I've been watching, looking for the, but you are going to hear Mazen Namdekan on the radio. And at the same time, what Peter B said about Mazen Namdekan. Ah, our people. Our people. Very easy. What This thing is very easy. What we just need is just determination. Determination and at the same time consistency to know what we are fighting for. Only many no obedient now. Quite well now. How will soon? No, no, the last and nothing. No protest. No, no, we ended after the court. And to tell you how wicked Nigerians are, individuals will be the next day later. Now so will be will be said will be said I'm coming with the fire. I've never lost. Uh, I've never lost case before. Uh, since I've been going to court, I've been winning. Please, I don't want all of you to go out there for protest because uh, they will shoot aside. Uh, hold on. We are going to, I'm going to drop my last of blood for Nigeria. These are agents of wicked souls are writing. They are telling people that this will be. What is, there, what is the reason behind it? To calm you down. To, to calm you down. That's what I'm doing. Now, I want you to listen as you are obedient. Maybe you come across this um, or this broadcast. Let us hear what Peter B said about Mazen Namdekan. I've been, I've been trying to get this. Uh, many of you know about Odenibo Radio. Now, why am I playing this? I saw so many of you on the man here obedient that time. Ah! I'm a obedient. It's a movement to no go there. They have more followers than even IPOB. They are followers across across the the whole Nigeria, even in the north. They're not the northern people are supporting him there. They don't know what they mean of ideology. Ideology. Very, very critical. And that is why I get so much annoyed when I see people defending Christianity. You see charlatans defending Christianity in the, in the open, fighting with one another, instead of fighting people for Biafra. All this noise, all these things that are paining you that people are talking against Christianity, you can actually be annoying when people are talking against Biafra. Biafra is supposed to be a sacrosanct to you. You can actually be fanatical about Biafra, not nonsense religion they brought to you. And your power statue as when the time comes. And just need you a while, a while. They boil my head. I'm up to one day. See your uncle. See your uncle. I will not solve freedom of speech. I know there for those ones when the time comes. Some of you, it pains me that you know how this thing came into our land. What pains me that they know when you ask them, hey, yes, it's true that they conquered us, but that, that is not now. It was then. Hey, do you know they kill us for us to become this? I know. But since you have accepted it, allow the freedom of worship on your tier. When you're not here, but you came and slaughter our people to believe in your own. And you couldn't appear anish. And you know the media warrior. And just now, can we go down some more? Now listen to this. Uh, listen to this. People are people are dying for what they believe in, for for the betterment of their land. What emanate from their land? You couldn't hold something somebody brought. You are insulting my Jesus. Somebody called me all the way from America. One idiotic and be serious forgets and be serious when I go know. Many of you that are will never and are be serious to get what we are looking for. Hand our awareness and calculate your awareness. And be serious. You see that guy in America can never hold position. Are they possible? Or no, or no, no, why? 
somebody that can, some a coordinator of this noble movement is calling me to all the way from America because I'm preaching about the evil they brought to us. He said he's going to sue me to court for talking against Jesus. That is his Messiah. Even on top of it, he's calling my ancestor very stupid. You are stupid ancestor. Now you are not struggling with Jesonic. And that is why even I tell you. Now, listen to this. This is a conversation on Radio Biafra, but I'm trying to see if I can be able to get a source on Odenibo Radio. Many of you know about Odenibo Radio. Let's see whether I have it here. Somebody called Mazen Namde Kano. I have been searching for that radio. I know many of you may know about Odenibo. Uh, this is where Peter B went. That, those times, nothing like a 2023 election. So that many of you will say he just said it because he lost. No. Peter B know how to free our people. Peter B know that Nigeria is not for us. But he just wants to do the job they send him. You, this is a somebody called Mazen Namlekano Radio Biafra. So exciting. Peter B told the guy in that, told the radio presenter, what all this thing Mazen Namlekano is preaching is correct. Now you that are watching me as an obedient, I want you to know the chance. Some of you are telling us, uh, uh, just allow us to do this. If we fail now, then we now know how we will show you people how to do Biafra. Who are you people? Let's go and see who is there. Is the line jammed again? No, I don't think so. Morning. Good morning. Your name and where you are, please. Yes, my name is Isishuko Okoye. I'm calling from Asaba, uh, from Anambra State. Thank you. Go ahead. Country. Go ahead. Yes, direct from Nandekaro. I must, I must, I'm very, very overwhelmed. I must appreciate you for the good work you are doing for the Biafran people. Thank you. Yesterday, something happened yesterday morning, by this time. Yes. In Odenable FM, when uh, Mr. Peter B was there, right, I was very shocked when Peter B was telling the whole people in, uh, uh, in uh, Odenable FM that he used to listen to Radio Biafra. That everything Nan De Carlo is saying in Radio Biafra is true. He said it yesterday by 10 o'clock. Some people can confirm that also. And those of you that are watching, I want you to time when you kiss you retreat for that particular broadcast. I've been searching for it. You know, Nigeria doesn't keep record. And when any of you, let me refresh this. I'm not seeing people's comments. How they play again better. We are going to be, we are going to call viewers. Okay, now I can see. Please, I want you to access to this broadcast. I need it. I have been searching in it, you know, then you actually me I am off on the in the Thomas. This is in 2015. When this broadcast was made, this is um which date is that? April tenth, two thousand and fifteen. In other words, Peter B went to Denibo uh, on 9th of April because the guy said yesterday, which is this broadcast we are listening now is tenth of April in the morning. Uh, I'm 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 talking to you as an obedient. Oga, uh, Oga, son, be afraid. Everything Mazen Nam the Khan is saying is true. Yoga. No be that in the chariot on Nigeria around. Now, this is it. Question Agachala. That's why I don't want to play it before. I know why I keep this sense. So that God say Matusal, I want to uh, make the whole world don't vote for Peter if they hear say he's he do listen to Rodo Biafra. If people hear say uh uh Peter B say everything I'm the kind of saying is correct. I had the election at Gala, so the Carlo is saying in the good Biafra is truth. He said it yesterday by 10 o'clock. Some people can confirm that also. And Peter, 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 B, Peter B said this on radio yesterday. Yes, yes, Peter B. Peter B, former governor of Anambra State. He made this statement yesterday by 10 o'clock, yesterday morning. You are on air also. Uh, he was there also because I listen to Radio Biafra through my phone. Every morning, every evening, I listen to Radio Biafra. Every day. So he was there telling the people that he used to listen to Radio Biafra and he, he, whatever every man the Carlo is saying in Radio Biafra is truth. He did not deny anything. 
He said that that what the wrong man is saying in Lagos Biafra is 110% truth. And what about his anger? You know, he said this thing, said he said this thing on the Denubo FM yesterday. I am I am 110% sure telling you this. He said it is a high time also a job depot uh, Delta, uh, Niger Delta will come to Igbo together to a match at one. This lady, is what lady, he said. Lady, 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 this lady, is a very good information and I love this. And I'm very, very happy that somebody like uh, uh, Peter will be to listen to Little Biafra. Everybody does. Everybody, including Obama listens to Little Biafra. There is nobody, the whole CIA, <laughs> MI5, <laughs> to <laughs> Elizabeth. Everybody, <laughs> Little Biafra is compulsive listening. On your mama, hold there. What is he saying? For those of you that don't know what he's saying, that thing that P2B say, what that young man is preaching is correct. What is that that is correct? Nigeria is not for you as a Biafran. You are going to die as a result of being in Nigeria or being a Nigerian or supporting Nigeria. Nigeria was a business center. The name was called Royal Niger Company. It's for business purposes. Other people, they change the child their name. Oh, no, no, no. They claim giant of Africa. Somebody name you a name, call you bingo. And you're asking that bingo, telling the man that he, uh, we are wise now. Naja, Naja no the carillas. So what is Peter B saying, Mazen Nam the Khan is saying correct is because Mazen Nam the Khan said, Nigeria is not for us. Something struck to me today. The man many of us are using, that man the head is in 200 naira note. Or the man that told white man that Igbos are domineering. I could be an ass why I have no idea at that time. That man who issued an attorney and I know the killer of our people. And I parade the Kishi Jagazo. This is what happened, and that is why Mazen Nam the Kano, please ride on, ride on small a bit. Your people are here. We have a special affinity with the creator of the heavens and the earth. His name is Chupukika Biyama. What I called Almighty. Creator, mm. only those who are blessed to come close to him can ever know him. Mm -hmm. That is the meaning of Chuko Kikabiyama, in case you don't know. The only name that angels call him in heaven. Oh, how? Oh, he wants a man to the what only what complete saw. name is Chuko Kikabiyama. That shows how special we are. This evening we are live and direct, and I must go on to remind everybody, in case you do not know, that I am Nam the mm. the leader of indigenous people of biafra all over this very planet Earth. I, I, I command the armies of biafra so also do i direct radio biafra mm. i can only do all of these things with the grace of the same therefore by your mercy by your grace O lord of hosts I will serve the wonderful people of Biafra diligently, honestly, mm. never retreating in the face of any adversity. We are seeing it. Always mm. preaching this gospel in truth without fear of anybody. Always making sure that consistently this very family all over the world understand our very simple stance and creed. We look after our own. Die. We look after the children the most. How can then they also to remember my daddy and mama? And we go go much in it. True-blooded Biafrans. This is your platform. Mm -hmm. This is your program. Let us preach this gospel for mankind to understand. And you accepted it because you are inferior. Black people from Africa have consistently demonstrated that they are infinitely inferior. That in Peter B said that what that young man is preaching is correct. This is one of it. I, 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 so, so, so. To their Caucasian European counterparts. Mm. Because Europeans came and defined your boundaries for you. You, that is Europeans right. came and told you who your relatives are, who you should be in the same country with, who you should inhabit the same geopolitical space with. Mm. You cannot do the same thing in a white man's land, but they can come to your place and create artificial countries with artificial boundaries and artificial flags. I know, I know. My question was therefore very simple. Mm. Are you telling me 
that your grandfathers or some of you, your great grandfather, even for some of us, our fathers who are older than the zoo, called Nigeria, that they never had a country. They never existed until the white man came. Because if you accept the notion of one Nigeria, it means that you have abandoned your history, you have jettisoned who you are. My question will always remain, what was your name before the name Nigeria came into existence? That in PWB say, that what that that in that young man is preaching that is correct all these things but oga kora ka oga wo the present e di ri e di e di ri e di ha so wo kute wo kute ndi igbo ha so wo kute i don't want to mock at many of you me am you know now okay anyway ke ke nke wo we which direction na kai news peace we amabala amabala america get your pvc no ba oh hala pvc oga was america I'm a kind of all do the so do the follow to me because of him. Kaha or Ogashi colleague. Ha ha luna. Ha ha luna street. One of the wiki crazy. Very soon now, obey disappear. What was the name before the zoo or logical republic came into existence? That is who you are. The sooner you go back to it, the better for everybody. The sooner you return to your original position, oh, actually, the better it is for your psyche, for your prestige, mm. and for common sense. You inhabit or you should inculcate within your skull and your brain. These are the things we teach here and we must continue to teach it. This is Radio Biafra. Okay. Live and direct. And Chukukika Biama is of course presiding. I will bring our news headlines to you. From outside the zoological republic. You would think that the zoo that the British created called Nigeria. Inhabited by monkeys and baboons. That somehow they have an economy. No they don't. They have what is called a rentier economy. There is a difference between an economy and rentier economy. Rentier economy is where you sell, it's like a banana republic, but only this time around with crude oil. You sell only one produce. And from there, you get all, you purchase everything else you're looking for, including toothpick from abroad, which is also important. Economic growth, they are saying. My question to Buhari is that you are sounding like Nkoso Konjiwala. Which economic growth, which sector is growing? Oh, I'm sorry, maybe the fraud sector. Or the uh, uh, election tribunal sector. Right. As I said this evening, you will now see that Radio Biafra is where they mm. all get their news from. We tell them what to do and they do it. This evening I will prove it to you as we go along. Buhari is talking about economic growth, not translating to improved well-being. What this liar is saying, an Islamic liar for that matter, is that somehow you can um, convince idiots that uh, the zoo called Nigeria has an economy that is growing. My question is, can you please give us an economic breakdown of your, just your GDP? Tell us which sector is growing. Nobody is buying the, the greatest earner you have is crude oil. Nobody is buying crude oil. You are no longer allowed to export foodstuffs to Europe for people in the diaspora that may want to buy goosey or yam. Ghana has overtaken you on that. You don't export palm oil. Malaysia is on top. So what do you I forgot fraud and stealing, corruption and looting? Maybe that was what he meant. That the new the corruption in the zoo being perpetrated by themselves has not translated. Hold up there, our leader. <laughs> Hold up there. Go and get your PVC or off a lacquer. Look here, here now. Go and get your PVC now. Look here. No time. They don't care for many of you. My little queer feel there. How can I about any at all? And as I will jump and down. So if we be, if the robber be, can't stay there and fight. Ha ha, try their way. Look here, guy, yalla. <laughs> Go and get your PVC now. Oh my no, he could see you grow up. I knew we had a car. He had a car. He had a car and I could not. Um, the truth of the matter still remains. 
we are going nowhere. Obedient people. I am still asking how far now get the direction now. Movement or wala. I know they move again. Could I question that one place? I know it's just for time or something. If they rob you, you are mandated. You go and sit down. We encourage all of you to come out on the street. Begin to ask questions. Like play, like play, like play. Finish. Very soon, the person that will come and the rule many of you will be here. Like Mohammed. After Like Mohammed, I told you, I let this one be in charge of Boko Haram. Our people. Now let's go. Uh, and we know they're here. Like I said, calamity still remain the way to talk to our people. Calamity still remain the only way to talk to our people. This is what is going on in um, where we come from. And sometimes, when we begin to talk about our elders, so many of you will say we are insulting our elders. Any day something begins to happen, I will know that we started the struggle. Any day I see sign, I will tell you that we are now into freedom of Biafra. I cannot get awareness. I'm not my baby, this man on now. I don't know where he is now. I'm not my born. Oh, no, no, I'm really my born. I don't know where he is now. I'm not too bad now. I don't just understand now. Why am I this man on now? I don't know where he is now. Um, I, no, no, no. Oh, um, I think, um, the thing has gone off. This is not what I wanted to play. Interface with the real people who are the people that are holding the masses. Rather than uh, abusive works in bathrooms in the in the Dulles that we decided to extend the hand of friendship uh, to the north. Having said that, um, we ask one question ourselves. What happened to the relationship between Namdazikiwe and Tapala Belewa? What happened to the existing relationship between the north and the east? Where did we got it wrong? What majority population of Igbos are residing in 19 northern states? With the highest investments we have in 19 northern, we have about about 2.3 trillion worth of investment Igbos that have been invested in northern Nigeria. And by so doing, we said no. That the best thing we have to do is, and moreover, you have heard, or it's not a new uh, agenda, that this is the turn of the Igbo people. And uh, irrespective that our friend here who have been having another uh, diverse opinion that the North must restore power uh, after President Muhammad Buhari, we say no. It's not something that will come and fight in the Delhi's or every time we'll be you know, countering what he say. No, let us come and have a persuasive dialogue. In the Southeast now, there is no, today is Monday, the, the economy is crashing. Somebody somewhere is dead at home, not in Nigeria. And everything is going wrong. What we need is somebody who is of age. We are looking at age. Somebody who can unite Nigeria as Nigeria to be one. And that is why we are here to say that we believe in one Nigeria. And also we are ensuring that we are persuading our brothers to support us. We, have had it. we are not expecting any response from them now. Let them go and think about it. Abundance of uh, material resources that can succeed President Muhammad Buhari. Quality and acceptance in the north. You talk about Senator uh, Richard Sokoracha, who, uh, who was even born like in Nandasigwe, was born in the north. You talk about international diplomacy. We have uh, our Minister for Foreign Affairs, um, Joe Ronyama, who has helped President Muhammad to launder the image of Nigeria. When you talk about infrastructural development and uh, this, you talk about the governor of uh, Ebony State, um, Governor Dave Umai, is not is to come and look at not the region, but look at the quality of candidates, people who are ready to serve Nigeria, people who are ready to continue to salvage the image of Nigeria beyond the way we have descended so low and so, uh, you know, into the abyss of violence, abyss of insecurity, poverty, and all the rest of it. So we are uh, uh, begging the North begging. that they should look at the individuals, not at the region. Because looking at the region, we will be misunderstood that we want Biafra. Looking at the region, we will be misunderstood that we have there will be no confidence for the North to trust somebody from the East. Looking at the region will give us another perception that perhaps will lead us into not having. So why we are saying this is that the North through the Arewa Consultative Youth Forum should help us. To help us, okay. To ensure that the North plays the role of a kingmaker king in 2033 
and look hey, play, at the hey, play, hey, play, hey, play, hey, play the thing now. He said they should play the the role of a king in Macau. Oh, that's that's what they did now. When I hear that market women are falling in the name of sit at home, I remember this people. These are the people that are supposed to be bearing the consequences. Not to um open your fish in my support to our tea or heavy affair. Any day in the radio, I will know. These are people that put us in a mess. These are the people when they look on us, they say, But we know their fathers now. Their fathers are cowards. They don't know the one that are calling me. So, how can a coward give birth to brave men like this? They say they need Biafra. And we have been killing all of them. They don't want to rest. The more we kill them, the more they come out. I don't know their father that are cowardly came and be begging us. So, before you do something to somebody, you look out upon the father. We will anger this own India in public. Any idiot to better now, we don't have a respect for others. Thunder will destroy our whole entire generation. They went down here with chaff. Useless men. If I begin to bring you a lot of them, begging, begging the north, they knew, they know that the current structure of Nigeria can never allow any evil man to be on the hems of affairs. If you talk nonsense, election politics is a game of number. They don't have the number, but they have located the number to themselves through the census. These people know all these things. They know they go nowhere. They know. They, not only that they have the population, they have also the rigging. Not only they, they know how to rig, they also have the contact of our slave masters. These people know these things. The only way we can break away is either I you could hand over, but it's so bad. It's so bad. Oh, why? Oh, why? You must sometimes on a deca and your mellow and your mellow vast stress all these issues on the question. I know in front. I and you and you and you like this. I'm back. I begin to talk about Biafra so that let the world be here also that you people are speaking about Biafra. But I know Google Biafra and Google Nigeria. And if the international communities comes on their can meet or anyone on the street, you don't know. And they meet all these uh, so called politicians. Now, what is Okaru now is crying because he hear that they want to deny him of being senior president. In other words, he was all this time working for his own interest to become senior president. He supported the Muslim Muslim ticket. Now they are telling him that he's like, we are going to give us a senior president a Muslim. Yes, now it's an injustice that he, he cannot take it. He didn't say, if you people try it, I will not, I will do something. He said, if you try it, I will blame, I will hold people to be responsible. Ndiya kweshi kila yinuza. Hei kwe, eki ila cha hanuza, gina na biafra gana agaga. Ongo nende ka pata kuwa kudi sins, gina hwa. Ayin ni le fos han, hei kwe, oh, abashi ya hwa. Any day, I mene, I inform no that, that of, that unit of doing this sins. Things gane move, we move. Ayin ka baada gana, ayin ka wano na. Ayin ka, unu wama pa, unu wagi biya mi witres. Brother, ayin ka na wakwa wano yin joku. So these are the things we see here, and sometimes our people know they're here. Even even Umobonya, not only politicians, Umobonya, I'm on more stupidity. All these and they could come back home, come back home. They say they are not going to come back. Like we care, 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 but I'm a car grat. I'm a monu hiya, monu 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 hiwa nyami. Like we, like we, I'm a car. Cars is the mission. I lost a property. I'm lost millions. Ah well. I'm lost millions. So you Foolish people. Get your sign on sense. Nothing there, bro. Oh. Can I ask you English? Oh, absolutely. Oh. Lost her all. In the early hours of Thursday. I had got at your lowest pass market in Lagos, yes, destroying properties worth several millions of naira. Mm. According to eyewitnesses, instead of caught about 3 a.m., some shops in. New York, I just wake you up, New York. Look at how the Nigeria is reading your news. Eh? Some shop just gone to bond. They, they don't want to talk about the source. So if you, after listening to this broadcast, this uh, particular video, you can never hear so it's suspected to be something like, you know, a shop to just got to bond. Nobody speak about and there's one guy I've been looking for. Please, that guy, I need you. I, I don't know where you are. I don't know. There was a guy that um 
Nigerian police pushed from two-story building where they were asking him for money. On a, he he sometimes come to my program lo long time ago. They push him up. He fall from two-story building. And now he become crippled. He can't do anything again. The mother has been pushing him in, um, in Whittier. That was the time he came to my program long time ago when I don't have the interest of raising any money for anybody. I, I, I do see him. And um, that is the day I realized that. You see all this Vanguard punch, all this uh, daily to all this uh, daily sun. Anytime they put you on um, on um, on it on a screen like to carry a problem and come to the public like this, they have their own share. Like this thing now, this uh, Vanguard that are showing these people now. If they brought, if they bring them um, help to these people, like say give one million, Vanguard have their percentage. And then very lion percentage. The guy told me. Because I, I told him, but I saw you on Punch newspaper. Now Punch have carried you. That is where we saw you. At least people have raised you a lot of money. He said no. That they raised him almost 2 million. But they gave him 200,000 naira. And then collect 1.8 million. So sometimes, you know, all this, um, all this vanga, all this newspaper. That's what they do. There's no charitable in Nigeria. So this is what happened in Lagos. So they wake up. Oh, they wake her up. Gradually. Yes, in 2019. Yeah, yeah, yes. Yes. I'm looking for the guy. I don't know what about. Because I similar like I sent a call three weeks ago at the Akira Step Art Market. Because the information I got. Look, I care about the business. Also, also, English. I will trade out. I will quickly learn. I know we're graduates. But no, 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 they are begging to trade it. It's for around one. And they called me around three. And nobody, I'm living at some group. But I know how much, because this is very shop. And you know how very expensive. And we lost a lot. Okay. A lot. Okay. You can see people, sympathizer, coming around to Ibo sympathize man. with us. Ibo man. Things. As I am, I don't have any other shadows that they want to have. Even my neighbor, this is the one they have. And we know the effort they're putting to build the shop. The fire now. I will, will call the try calling the um, fire service. But they came. Uh, the, uh, you know, we sell gas, we give the gas. We see gas. To market at Uibo. Mostly what I'm building on. Kia Watai. Kia Wakiu from the so called Naja Death. Kia Watai. I'm going to kill the Nimbami. So, open an onion, then I was a little bit. Here's a lot of mama going to have a different level or different men. So, I went to market on Friday, that was last week. I bought a market worth of 3.14 million. Not the one that, that was there already. On this thing, I went to Ladebo. On Tuesday, this week, I went to Ladebo. For the Kumbo aspect of it, I went to Ladebo to buy also good uh, compressors, condensers, they are all gone. I hired them, I called the river, they brought us here. We were sleeping and then. Don't Let us hear her name. I am Becky Onyako. Becky Onyako. I want to know why. Becky Onyako is your sister. Am I ham or Teddy? Here I am. We were sleeping and then. Don't tell me. When they called us at Apa, I was shopping for this. Getting this place, everything has burned down. I've lost millions. I've lost millions. I don't know why. I'm very, very surprised. I don't know that a day like this will be and I will be among them. When they come to people that lost their son in Lagos, I don't know that I will be among them. But so many places, so many places, so many places. I don't know why. I say, I say, Esipa, Esipa. Oh, mother. Everything I didn't pick, pin. You can see it there. Everything. Bones. I didn't pick P. I didn't pick P. I can't go see because I keep on the moment I'm selling, I keep on replacing them. So how I many how many they are shop up? It's so a man, but what I roughly estimate is something about twenty, twenty something million that we lost there. 
whether we like it or not, it's gone and it's gone. So I don't know. So I'm appealing to whoever that is in authority to come to our aid. This is where I'm, 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 I'm making my living. I don't have any other thing. All I have is gone. So, we... Nigeria. Nah, mkuoku, mkuoku, God on the other side. Ha, hey, feel that I'm on you, baby. As this thing, as this thing have gone down now, I want to pray that you zoo iron on there, as condemn iron, and I read As this shop now was just more down, I want to pray that now I thought iron for sale. I got you there some other place. I'm gonna do one on one. I saw it to cook it cook. Can't have another level. Can't have another. Can't have this kind of discussion or indoors discussion with people that have a frontal lobe. You could have a hammer. I said, Look at the material. I don't even believe in anything. Some of them wrote me one day, uh, I got this year a taste. I don't know how we can accommodate you in Biafra and a taste. <laughs> I just say taste in her job. <laughs> it is when you believe in anything, which is normal. Somebody can decide to say, no, you want her to believe. Now, uh, I am a chalati and a go. I am a chagoru and a go. Our brothers, they are frank on talent. Hey, Tiruni and a go. So, because only return over. I'm a mugger, I say, Apple Marker. Apple Colla, these small boys. I saw them. If I come back home, I have no more mark. Hapo kolande hapo ha wo mo 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 frontal mo mo jobless na me kanu dey na say come back home hapo ha lag is our hometown we are locations we have sent it in a message in a music i make try tie tie na egu am mad of the shop uno come home Ibo, the great people in Doma. Leave them there, leave them there. I want to thank all of you that are here already. I want to begin to thank so many of you that are here. Uh Metisola will be descending. Metisola will be descending. We we have cowards among our midst. Who are claiming some of them said after this election that if we be loose, they are going to join the Afghan struggle. <laughs> I want one lady, Sahia Dr. Chi Global. I'm no I'll run e I'll I know like you know who coy. Okay, rubbish, clear rubbish. I tell you. I want you go with one voice. I'm I I I love what is going on. What is going on is bringing everybody together to the direction of IPU. I'm telling you. A lot of people have repented, but because of the, the the pomposity in them, they don't want to begin to speak because people have known them to be castigating them, the kind of castigating IPOB. So now, because of that pomposity in them, they want people to begin to say, ah, I thought you have been against these people now. Why are you not speaking in favor of them? Some of them are not mute. Oh, nobody who knew who now. One oh pomposity in your soul. The Quenka, Opera say this election now. Uh, who, why did you people discharge Nam the Kano? It's not that I don't like that he has been released, but why now? Now that PTOB is making a wave, look here. Those who walk there know a Rakan to Swasa Chayan. The moon is come back home, uh, come and marry, marry from your tribe. Taz is just on it. Uno Huma and in Neleduna, Osogori Auro, Osogori Ishi from Pakistan. At least, no one is more pay. One is rubbish. One is where where we don't have we have perfect woman. No no one. No one. No one. We have their own flaws. My my catch I go to my catch you inch. On that channel here support why you are this our journey. No one will do you inch. No one does again. Can I go? Especially in the in America. Taz is doing Jasonic. Foolish people. Look here, sir doctor. We can eat your king. Hold your mama. Everyone needs needs shikos. Look here. Foolish people. 
Ok, I'm, 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 I'm not without, without, look here, look here. You're quite a number. What tell them to our video? How long can Mars Nam the Kano? No, no. How long can on a prison? Uh -huh. Get him up. And nobody talked about him being in the prison. Now, I can tell you, yeah, 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 was a problem. Nobody was there. He went to court many times and they refused to let go. Okay, so now Peter B is in the system and Peter B is competing to be the, the president of Nigeria. Okay. Ndibo. No, no, you guys no. don't let Ndugu use your brain, you know, if go. Or if you be Afra, I ain't a Zokita. I ain't a Iso. Iso has a annoyer. What have you contributed? Be Afra, I ain't a Zo. Na, 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 I'm on your crown, you know, I don't just understand. We we have to have somebody there. Genyela and Yaka, even with that be Afra. Oh, yeah. So, Ndugu for Kita, na Pito be in a gain momentum. Okay, and another momentum. Okay, and another momentum. And if care is not taken, now Peter will be a win, Nigerian president. Or if you go, Nyaka Fadi will wrap up the canoe. Queen Honey, 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 had he been the the freedom man that time, and he never said anything, they would say, nah, nah, because of this man, the release, that's why people didn't come out where the way they're supposed to come out. Look what? Look what? You guys don't think like Narapo M M M N K Mazin Nam the Kano because they want to let him go. Harapo Mazin Nam the Kano so they can put confusion in the system. Wait, honey. They can distract Ibos. Because from mana, Pito will be born Ibo. Now, now I have to have one to or able to the distraction. Pito will be a winner. Do you see the wickedness in us? I'm going to care. She may be doing it on purpose. All right. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. No, no, Facebook. Hey, look. Some of them thought that and after. A lot of our women now, what I, I, I don't, it's, not, it's, not, it's not that I'm trying to be arrogant. Anyway, anyway, we have our women that are so preserved. Have you heard Uruku with that one side? You can have Facebook, even, even you'll be watching to see the face. Hey, with all co all co camera, but she said, Pentitina. If you ever say this, I give you a hoodie leaf, it gets in my own guinea. And I have said somebody's breaking their hearts. You can't show your real face. And when you rock, you don't know paint each other. You don't know how to do it. You don't know how to do it. You don't know how to do it. Very smooth. Because you don't know how to do it. I have a problem. Before the snap picture on Facebook, they would do like this. Or again. You don't know how to look for the ass. You don't know how to do it. 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 What is the cause of this problem? Oh, now I'm being able to do it. What happened? Look here. Look here. And Peter B means well for everybody. Okay, if you go, and a lot of people, yes, more than not campaign to to go. I chalk a bia for bia. Man, you guys, the question I want everybody to ask now, yes, I'm happy now, Rappo. I'm happy, I'm happy, I'm happy. The question I want everybody to ask now, bro. why now? Why okay, now? Why now? Why now? Why now? So that Kafa will maybe help it to be fair. Why now? Why now? Why now? Why happy now? Why now? Why now? Why now? happy? now? Why happy? That's why now? That's why now? Why now? But madam, they didn't release him now. So why did not Peter be failed? Why now? No, I Facebook. But this is what God says. And King Wetre, he did tell you to be serious. After two days, how you are here? You get one problem, why get now? Not your oil, which means I'm in home. You got solve that problem. There are anyone on here, and I don't have to be the only care about to brand the normal or the other. I'm a crime. Brand who working on all. 
on that my man special program you know all the yeah or to manage and you're gonna know under two days apart from their their problem please it's not that i am i have one problem now so again let's do the problem there and how they will not talk what is it that's one problem that is bothering me i don't know sorry that i'm just asking you for help and yeah me yeah he could you okay i'm gonna give it a help come see now get out get out from there I don't want to cause her back. I only got frustration. I understand their situation. You know, you can't turn on the beer for all this. say disappear. I tell you. Oba. And I will oba. Now, this is one of them. They got another person. They got another person. They got another person. Um, where is this one? I say, I'm not going to be afraid. I'm going to be afraid. I'm going to be afraid. And what broke out? I will tell you simply okay. about coffee, sit at home, and all of that. Let me tell you, okay. and I'm saying this clearly. I'm not saying this from the depth of my heart. If of the day, God forbid, oh, Peter B does not win, and it turns out that the Ebos betrayed their brother. Let me tell you the truth. And you come out to say eh, we want Biafra, we want Biafra. And what broke out? I will tell you seriously that we will all be against you. I will tell you seriously that it will so shock you that we will be against you because rather than fight for a common problem that affects all of us, you chose to fight for yourself. You, you chose to look at your own interests. We have a people that are dominating and controlling the whole country. Everybody is suffering it. The, 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 the Benue State is suffering. Taraba State is suffering. Katina State is suffering. Everybody, you are not the only ones suffering the ego. Besides, you are not even. Can you compare the life of an Igbo man to the life of Christians that are being killed every day in Southern Kaduna and Mubi in Adama State? That's one. Garant. Let this be a fratin. Chill for now. Oh, chill. I'm not saying do. I'm not saying do. Well, oh, chill. Now, I'm chill. Now, then what next now? Please get me right. Okay. I'm not saying don't fight for Biafra. Okay. But you have to be perfectly strategic in what you're doing. Right now is a bad time to be talking about Biafra. Absolutely bad time. We are almost winning. Let it not be that it is we that defeated ourselves, not our enemies. Okay. Then. If, however. They went now. If, however. We. Have what? done everything right. Uh -huh. The Igbos came out 100 percent, at, at least near 100 percent, which they did to support the presidency of Peter Obi. Uh -huh. We all saw it that Peter Obi overwhelmingly win the southeast. Okay, or won the southeast. Okay, and well, at the end of the day, he is declared, or evidence shows that Peter Obi won this election. Okay, and for some reason, they have. Refuse to give him election. Uh -huh. Let that time come. Uh, but but all you know, know whether you know how to fight for Biafra or not. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm saying. <laughs> so please don't make the problem of Nigeria. I'm not where I'm not I'm not I'm not I'm not so that's why we wouldn't allow these people to derail what we are doing. When they come with this analogy, say, get out from my face. We have tried everything to convince many of you. So uh, we are appealing to those of you that are doing obedient. I'm on the direction now. I'm on the direction. No, no. I don't know your direction. We are begging many of you. So that is why you must make sure we continue doing what we are doing. They are, they are going to wake up, but it's very sad, Chai. It's very sad that up to this moment, up to this time around, I know what is holding us. We need to hold on to what we believe in. It's all, all about ideology. Ideology. I may have attempt idealize this Biafra in our mind. Will be like those of them that are out there looking for real freedom. But I won't hear you, church. We now 
Some of you are, are jump up. Why are you talking against my Jesus? So Jesus will come back here. Be a friend of the No, is it what you want to tell me? I know many of you that will say, I'll go hand before I'm So Jesus is more important than Biafra. I don't know who be Jesus. So I don't know who be Jesus. The only thing that I have come on about him, who claim his people know your God. How power is. Who know about Jesus? I don't know who be Jesus. I don't know who be Jesus. I don't know who be Jesus. This is what we are saying. Look here, let me brother. Look here, whatever I'm for. Oh, it's one I grow for. Look here. I say, oh no, Holy Spirit, come and deliver. These are the stories we don't want. Look here. Good morning, uh, yeah. love, uh, brothers and sisters. Look here, throw the cable. Something that I have never experienced before uh, happened. Happened today in my life. You went. And I am standing here as a priest of God mm. to testify what I saw. Mm. What I experienced with my two naked eyes. Oh, yeah. As a novice, when I was in the novitiate, I read a lot of books to also receive the Holy Communion mystically. Mystically. The Holy Communion that comes down from heaven. Yeah. This thing happened so many <laughs> years ago. <laughs> and since that time, I kept on reading so many books concerning saints with mystical characters mm. and uh, I developed so much passion and love for them. Mm. Yesterday, I arrived at the Divine Wound Holy Mountain mm. where I went to go and receive the face of God to go and pray. Pray, yes. And after the prayers, we started with the Holy, oh, well, husband, they may all pray. <laughs> holy Mass. And then, after the Mass, yes. exactly 12 o'clock, our sister, Sister Martina of Oka, mm. entered into the passion experience. Wow. She started bleeding the blood of Jesus Christ wow. from her two eyes. The blood of Jesus is bleeding from her, her eyes. Wow. It was a very wonderful experience. Father After is a series of prayers, mm. our Blessed Mother Mary came and uh, delivered her message wow. why she was crying wow. because of the sins of the world. So the, the mother is crying for it, but he can't solve the problem. He's only crying for the sins of the world. And the things that are happening in the church. She cried and cried and cried and cried. After delivering the message, the victim showed the mystic sister of ours, Sister Martina of Oka, begged and interceded yes. on behalf of the world and on behalf of all the members in the church. Who have offended Jesus in one way or the other. Not offended God or Jesus. Another thing that shocked me so much that I want to really testify here today is that the prayer that I prayed as a novice, begging God to grant me the grace to receive Holy Communion mystically. Mystically. It happened today. Life and the At exactly 6.20 a.m. Correct. Friday. Correct. At the first. 2023. Father, got you in here. Got you. I grow. Got for food. Father, I, I Reverend Father Doctor Peter Uche Onoha, witness the miraculous, the mystical reception of the Holy Communion mm. by our sister, Mat Sister Martina Ofoka. Martina Ofoka. While the prayer was going on, mm -hmm. the next thing we heard, she said, "Amen." Wow. In a loud voice. Wow. Immediately, Holy Communion appeared from nowhere. Wow entered into her mouth. Wow. I cried. Hi. Because most of us, we celebrate the Holy Eucharist without knowing what we are celebrating. Because I have prayed for this kind of a thing to happen since I was a novice, that mm. I'm praying to receive the Holy Communion mystically from mm. the book. Mm. I have to go to her mouth mm. and I divided the communion and I also received it. Correct. The same thing we have in the Holy Eucharist. The Correct. same thing that was no difference. Correct. In the front of Sister Chinye, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 And my husband could go Christianity. <laughs> if he did this man out to let's go and carry gun to defend ourselves. I'm going to say mystical will do it. Brother, why not I want to go? Has us on now. I'm the against their belief. Making a term at this, making it insult us. 
Ni o kro na le le to ji okay kam okay let us assume this true now how does this thing help us as people you receive the holy communion mystically the thing that fall off from heaven that bag on look what you hear when you go on as when you on about a when you coach you don't coach you now now my my girlfriend I know we join you now I know we join you now. But I don't know how to story now. Why not I believe in him or here now? Somebody we can't go and meet you. He never see you. It's true. There, there now here. Now come. There here. Chine kabo mala walk now. There here. Meet you. It's true. So things happen. For the fact that he've never gotten the grace. You know, it's those that into spirit we see it. It happened to our uncle. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm even ready. I'm even ready. I'm even ready. I'm going to know. People are ready to get me. I'm going to know. Uh, it's okay. I have to leave many of you here. Look at the father. 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 Look at the cross. Look at the cross. We have I had as I saw it. I witnessed it. I saw it. Because what Ehia said something. Ah, the plate number of the... I saw the plate number of the Virgin Maria, I had M. <laughs> <laughs> I saw the Virgin Maria with a plate number, I had M. Mm. I had H M or Wimbo State House of Assembly. Again, was the number. Virgin Maria with the number. Since 20 p.m., mm. that miraculous incident occurred and happened. Another thing that shocked me in this physical encounter, when our Blessed Mother Mary was talking about how priests are no longer valuing the power that God has given them in the Holy Eucharist due to the unbelief of so many and of you can sit down, God Our lady asked sit down. some of us who were there to go and smell the blood that our brother, our sister was bleeding. The first person that smelled the blood was a reverend sister, Asomta Okeke. Mm. Mm. Then one other man smelled the blood. I myself, Reverend Father Dr. Pitu Chonoha, when I smelled the blood, the blood was smelling like the other wine we use in celebrating the so like also there was no difference it was pure other wine so blood of mary will wine uh -uh. which is alcohol now father father whatever are you so the blood of virgin maria is testing alcohol but the moon say to drink alcohol is the same the same other wine that i i took after consecration, the body and blood of Christ, that was the same other wine that we are perceiving. Yeah. It was a miraculous encounter. And something that is very, very, very <laughs> disturbing to me, that yeah. made me to be in shock. Yeah. I entered into my room where I was given, yes. only for me to remove my clothes. Even my singlet was even smelling like the other wine. I was confused. Wow. I was trying to relate what happened. How comes my singlet is now smelling like the other wine that we perceived there? I went back I took the handkerchief that our sister uh, we are using to uh, kind of clean the blood. At the moment we clean the blood, other blood will, will be coming out. So I took the, 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 the handkerchief, I smelled it, it was smelling like the other wine. I placed the handkerchief on my forehead, I placed it on my face, I placed it on my heart, well, and I prayed. I said, oh Lord God, heal well, every form of them. unbelief Good. in the hearts of all those who stay down. Your presence in the Holy Eucharist. Jesus is truly present in the Holy Eucharist. Jesus is truly present in the Holy Eucharist. Do not doubt him. Today, I have come to realize that the Catholic Church does not joke. That what we have as mysteries is really divine. It's really coming it's okay, from God. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. It's okay. I want to thank many of you that are here. Brother Akukan are weak. They tend to the moral as I have mind, but uh, nevertheless, we are going to continue when it's necessary. I want to thank so many of you that are here. I see Chukwe Madweke. I see Brem Boss. Ah, Mazan Namlikan, you could run on our land. You could drink our go in the church in Oka, Ndoka, Abrahukunoka, Ndoka. See to let this message of heaven that you on earth may grasp it, because here we speak the truth. The whole truth and nothing but the truth. Oh, is your good, Chineke? Hmm. 
Christians supporting mystical Holy Communion. Buhari is thanking them. Mystical. Not Saudi Arabia, because their their support for them is, is guaranteed. They are thanking US and the EU. I greet all of you, brothers. On Sunday, don't worry, you go to church, you contribute money. One of the one set goes to Canterbury in England, Anglican Church. The other one goes to Rome, Catholic Church. Then Pentecostal will cut it into two, give half to Europa and give the same half to America. If you're an Assemblies of God Church or Jehovah's Witness. Nobody is sitting down to say, who is going to take care of my daughter and my son? How will they go to good schools? Who is going to give them light and electricity? How about iPad? Why not my children playing with iPad and the Samsung tab and the smartphone to learn how to even play video games and then design it later? England. Some will go to Europe. How about an uncle? So why are we talking about these things? After doing all of that, the same Christians of Europe will always support Islam. And they say, Bukhari is thanking them. Isn't the, now, before you say we made it up, no, it is being carried by a newspaper in the zoo, a reputable one. Hmm. We block the news, we don't write them. Buhari hails EU, US for their role in the elections. That is the headline. <laughs> thanking Christians for helping him defeat a Christian or rigging him into power. Hey, there is God, though. I will miss that woman, honestly. I'm looking for one. I will leave it for Buhari you. Buhari is thanking EU <laughs> and the US for their role in rigging him into It's a national newspaper carrying it. Yeah, boy. Who said it? I'm going to go. I'm going to go. I'm going to go. I'm going to go. I'm this is maybe no to what we're going on Sunday. Christians in Europe, Christian brotherhood, they have abandoned you once again. The same people killing them. These are the same people that bombed the Twin Towers in America. This is the same people, the same Alakoba, the same Islam, the same terrorists that keeps killing every day, beheading Western hostages. Nobody gives a damn. When uh, oh, you people should be peaceful. Mm. If you are peaceful, the world will not recognize you. You see, Buhari, mm. that came out, are you telling me that CIA that knows everything did not know that Buhari is a terrorist? Is that, or even that CIA doesn't know that Buhari is a terrorist? Is that what you're telling me this morning? Are you telling me that the statement that Buhari opened his mouth and said about Sharia, that CIA did not hear about it? I'm not even talking about the one they discovered secretly. I'm saying, are you telling me that Obama CIA, Central Intelligence Agency in America, that specializes in killing black people that uh, who are intelligent, that's their job. They killed Patrice Lumumba. CIA killed um, Walter Rodin. They killed Thomas Sankara. It was the uh, England MI5 that killed Motala Mohammed. I will tell you who killed who. Where and when they planned it. We have all the data and all the information. Okay. CIA killed Thomas Sankara, killed Walter Rodney, and also killed Patrice Bumba. People trying to bring light to a darkened continent. But how about a mobilization? They so every evil they support. They are today supporting. Can you tell me that a Christian country is supporting somebody who said <laughs> that if he loses elections, <laughs> uh, 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 the, the blood of the people will be spilled? Okay, I've seen what I'm looking for. The state will be filled with blood. Well, I'm there, our leader. I have seen what I'm looking for. I want to thank all of you. I'm going to leave this thing for you in the next uh, how many minutes it will come to an end. In the next five minutes, it will come to an end. But I'm going to leave it uh, five minutes. It will come to an end. Prayer. Hold on there, Wally. If you don't... Oh, Wally, hold on there. I know people, somebody was asking me, I tried to replay this again. I will leave it. When you come to, I you know the program will come to. And I want to thank all of you that are already here. Remain blessed, brothers. Remain very, very blessed. And never be deterred. We are going to continue doing what we are doing. Nobody will distract us. I'm over to Jupiter. We must continue preaching the stupidity going on in our land. We are going to convene. This is the same people. The queer. Here when in 2000 and um, when they used to hear God drank tea with me in a Lauren Quara state. Here for the same, the same um, 
Fantasy. Non, il I noticed that the tea finished earlier before I should have. Et non, car des bruits. Côté miad. Là, il y a un programme. Ah, aussi, t'as dit, ma, I greet you. I see Ame Cherugo. Thank you, brother. I see Oguta Ekene Oscar. Ha, the radical. I greet you, brother. The radical media warrior. I see your handwork, brother Jishika. SMY Prince Isaac, I hail you. I see our brother Chinedu. I greet all of you. Uh, I'm a Tesla signer from the city of Vienna. Um, we are going to see anytime is necessary. Our brother Dave. Dave, I hail you. I hail you, brother. Cheka Biafra Samuel. Very, very loyal before all of you. A very chuku, Sonny Linko. Ah, I greet you, brother. I see Chijo Madoka. I see Obai Kejuku. Ah, our lovely brother Osino Nyeka. Ah, our lovely sister, Wanyoma. Wanyoma, I see you. I see you. I have seen your life and direct. Ah, Chris. Chris, I greet all of you. I'm beginning to see some of you that are here. One name, Mado. Ah, Sarah Gold. This one is an old, old Biafran freedom fighter. Ah, uh, brother, I want you to be there. Prince Wisdom. I see James Clinton. James Clinton, I greet you, brother. Ah, Ezeoku Bondo. Ezeoku Bondo is the key. Joseph Uchibeze, I greet you, brother. Good night from here. Uche Biafra, I want to thank all of you. Maybe the boy may not go out from here. SNY Prince Isaac, I hail you. Ike Chukun Naji, great Biafrans. Innocent Chuku Juku, one now more feeble can I call them correct. Ah, Obitus Jesus, can I adequate with Jesus on word? I'll go on my hijas, I'll go on word, brother. Provided you are not an extremist. Innocent to Kori, I hail you. And you catch him while. Agabo Benjamin. I greet all of you. I want to begin to descend. I want many of you to begin to enjoy this program. We're going to stay five minutes. It's come to an end. Innocent to Kori, David, you want to be here. And the Chukwema can be here. Monek, I see you. Pure man, Yahaya, or Yaya. Okay, it's a handy full of Brother, I know you, one of us. I know you, brother. I know you. I want to remember this. Just pay attention to it. Five minutes is come to an end, and then the program is over. I want to say that Nigeria is looking for solution, and we'll get it with prayers. If you don't have employment, prayer. If your lecturer is harassing you at school, prayer. If you don't have food to eat, prayer. If there is no bus to convey you to where you're going, no means of transportation, you pray. If you close your eyes, you'll be dead the next day. If you don't have any way to feed your children, you pray. If they kidnap your baby to sell, you pray. If they kidnap or rape your mother, you pray. If Hausa Fulani people are killing you, you pray. If Boko Haram is bombing you, you pray. Do you see how African people have bastardized reason and understanding? If anything happens to you, just pray. The same idiot saying this thing went to Abuja on an aeroplane built and manufactured by white people. He is wearing cloth tailored by white people. Everything he is doing is coming from the land of people who do not pray, but they do something. Everything he's using is half made in China. But in China, they're not Christians. They don't pray every two, two minutes. But they manufacture goods and services you can see that these useless people consume. These useless leaders calling themselves Christian leaders consume. Not prayer. How many times do they pray in China? How many times do they pray in the USA? How many times do they pray in South Korea that gives you Samsung? How many times do they pray in France that gave you Bosho cars? How many times do they pray in England that gave you the aerospace, the engine of the aircraft that you're flying in your private jet? How many times do they pray in a day? When there is unemployment where you are, I'm talking to those living in Europe, in Asia, and in America. Do Obama come out and say to those in America, hey, let us go and pray. It's prayer that will, will solve the problem. You develop economic policies to solve economic problems. Black people, African black people, please. You develop policies to solve societal problems, not prayer. Not prayer. That is modern day superstition. The same superstitious mumbo jumbo we had in the past has found its way back into the Bible, into the new interpretations of Christian doctrine. Pray, 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 left, right and center. 
the more you pray, the worse things become. The more your daughters become prostitutes. The more your men become essentially those that patronize prostitutes. The more your mothers are raped, the more your children can't go to school, the more people are kidnapped for ritual purposes, yet you are praying. But the container you imported from China is coming from a country that does not pray the same way you do. Yet they can make something. Yet they are blessed. But you claiming that you are praying morning, noon, and night, prayer, 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 you have nothing. But because you're an African, you cannot see that you have nothing. You are a black person, you cannot see that you have nothing. Your stupidity is so staggering, it is untrue. The stupidity of an average black African is so mind-boggling that it is unbelievable. Unbelievable. If you have problem, you pray. If you have miscarriage, you pray. Everything you pray. If you get to Roger Sokolacha, pray. Or if you get to Wasurike, oh, please pray that they can leave you. So when you land your container in our nature, they will not take 20,000 from you, those defending you. If, you, if, you're, if, if it's one of your sons at a zoo river, killed by P2B, go and pray. Don't take P2B to court. Go and pray. Go on, killed us. And we are still praying. Haran has killed us. We are still praying. It is that same prayer that led us to allow Omar Sanda Wachuku to go and representing us, to go and represent after killing us. You kill us, you go and represent Ndibu. You kill Igbo people, then you go and represent them. Because you are praying. Our people, you are not praying. You are dabbling in stupidity. It's not prayer. You are being very, very foolish. You're not praying. What can you make? What can you manufacture? What do you have in you to offer as goods and services to other people? Nothing. Don't need crude oil. Pray, 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 pray. I wish that um, some anyway, I don't want to speak against the, the Holy Spirit. That is what they want to do so that I will not see Biafra. They are mistaken. They are mistaken. That is the news we are presenting today.